Hi guys, hi guys, how are you doing and welcome back to another video. Uh, I know you guys have been waiting for the bedroom reveal for a very long time and today is the day that at least I get to share with you what has been going on in that room even though it's not the final reveal but at least you'll get to have a glance and uh, just a snippet of uh, what has been going on there because uh, we are not yet done, we are almost at the final stages and I'm hoping to share the final, the final uh, reveal next week. And if you haven't subscribed by the way, subscribe to my YouTube channel so that next week you get to see what all of us have been so anxious waiting on. So yeah, that is that. And uh, I also want to talk about my hair because I, I don't know, have you ever seen me in such a hair? No. This time around, my salonist actually, she told me not to do lines anymore because if you've noticed, I'm always in lines in braids such like things but this time round she told me to let's try something new and she did this on my hair and I love it so guys before we get into the video I would like to talk about a friend of mine I can say she's a friend because we've been talking a lot online and she also has a YouTube channel she does a lot of uh, home cleaning home organization and uh, home making videos and I love 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 her content and if you relate with that with such kind of content which i know you do because you're also watching my my videos i would actually like you to go support her guys because you know we need to support each other and encourage each other because uh, encouragement goes a long way so you can go check you can go check out her youtube channel i will leave the link to her account in my description box her name is Sombili and she's based in uk england yeah so please go check her out and uh, give her support support her and give her videos uh, a thumbs up so guys i will leave the link to her account in my description box kindly do check it out and uh her channel's name is the one that's currently showing on the screen let's give her support by liking subscribing and sharing her videos and uh, another thing that i would like to tell you guys is no let me share with you something that i got there actually I bought these things, sandals, sandak by Bata. I got this sandak. Uh, I got them from from Bata, and uh, I wanted a sandal that we could use uh, while in the just around the house, just looking around the house. And I found this to be they're much much better because they're rubber, they're rubber like, and they're soft. They are. Yeah, so I went with this because initially we have others that we've been using, but uh, I didn't want that type this time. I wanted something different. So that's the reason why I went for this sandak. And they're actually, they're, they're rubber-like and they're so soft. So I got these ones for me. And another one, I also got these blue ones for my hubby. These ones. Yeah, and uh, so those are the, actually, I got those two sandals i think they're sandals or sandak but it's written here sandak by butter so yeah these are these are actually the things that i wanted to share with you because they are useful uh while just walking around the house it's much better to have them on than uh, walk bare feet or on the tiles and the, the ones that we were using are actually they've worn out so i wanted something different this time that's the reason as to why i went for these rubber ones and i know they will serve us uh they will serve their purpose so that's another thing. So right now I think we will get into the video and uh, I hope you do like this one. And by the way, if you're new here, feel most welcome. My name is Monica and this channel is all about home cleaning, home organization and home decor. And if that is the kind of content that you are interested in, please, please, please do hit the subscribe button. And do not forget to hit the notification bell so that you get notified each and every time I post new videos. And also, guys, do give me a follow on Instagram. I will highly appreciate it. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So guys, uh, this is the before video of how this space used to look like. The wall was painted cream and uh, we sort of had everything in a brown. The bed, the bedding, the curtain, which made the space look darker and not inviting at all.
It was also kind of small and very basic. First of all, uh, I lost the clip of when the bedroom was being painted. This is actually the clip of the living room as it was being painted. But uh, I just placed it here to like kind of give the clear picture of what I'm talking about. Uh, yeah, we started by painting the walls brilliant white to brighten up the space and make it look a little bigger than it looked. And uh, the white paint sort of helped in bringing in a clean and modernized look to the space. Uh, after painting the wall, I had to work on the closets because the color was not giving me the vibe that I needed. Painting them was not an option because it could not work, more so since the material it is made of cannot really withstand paint. And uh, in due time, it will fade off. So yeah, that would have done more damage than good. So I opted to just use contact wrappings to cover it all up. It was a brilliant idea because I got to achieve the look I was going for. Uh, the next step was to refurbish the furniture that we already had, that is the bed and the bedside tables. I wanted them to be painted white, which was going to be quite a lot of work, uh, since for it to be completely flawless and completely get rid of the brown color to a point of invisibility, it had to first of all be sandpapered and guys, this was pretty hectic. Every detail had to be taken care of because I needed it to be perfect. So no matter how many days it took before the eventual painting, it had to be done.
so for painting we started by first applying the undercoat then there was first coat of paint then second coat then finally top coat which was i think in a spirit kind of substance which helped to give the bed that shiny look and boy you could not tell if it was initially a brown color or if it was white the turnout of that bed made me so happy and so proud of myself although it took several days to complete it was worth it but if i lay down and i play dead and i stay dead baby you get sick of being the monster out of my head under my bed think you're something out of my nightmares standing right there but if i lay down Silhouettes of you are like a taunt Never really know just what you want With you I don't ever feel calm I can feel the sweat inside my palms Play with me like cats and a string You don't understand the pain it brings You don't ever wanna give me wings You don't ever wanna set me free You know I'm addicted to you And it's twisted you've been gifted with the evil voodoo uh, so during those couple of days that the bed was being worked on, we were sleeping in the living room on the floor, which was awesome. It was very awesome. It did remind us of how much we've accomplished as a couple and appreciate each and every single step. I got issues in my head. I like you in my bed, but you keep me on red. Oh, everything is like a test. I better know. Uh, so guys, the next thing that uh, we did was to work on the accent wall, which uh, we painted grey. This was going to be the focal point and uh, it was also going to add individuality in the room. Personally, I love the color grey and it's actually the only thing that I thought of when I was choosing the color palette for this space. It is something that I can easily work around. It, it also defines me as a person. So it will uh, make the space look a little bit cozy and uh, more inviting. Feel the blood creeping up from the heathens Got will, got fight, got pride, got reason If they wanna go eat, then you know I'm gonna feed them If you're coming for me, hope you're ready for a demon I got eyes in the back of my head I'm seeing Take me for granted and you know I'm leaving I'ma take what's mine with the webs I'm weaving I could take this crap from seeing to believing Got a taste for blood and my tongue keeps bleeding From the words I spit, so sharp, so freezing So cold, behold, frostbite they feeling I could tear you apart or I could go heal them. Don't believe in fake, don't believe in ceilings. I just need a taste and my mind starts peeling. I don't pace myself, I grind on kneeling. Got lust for change, I just love the feeling. Uh. I ain't gonna give up. Got too little time, I'ma live up. Head down, push forward through the tough times. Cause anything worth doing is a tough climb. And I ain't gonna give up. Got too little time, I'ma live up Head down, push forward through the tough times Is anything worth doing is a tough Cause time Cause I'ma live life for the fight Yeah, I'm here to get it I got drive, got sight Always have a vision I go by at night I be in my feelings I'ma be fine, need time And I'll soon be winning I live life for the fight Yeah, I'm here to get it I got drive, got sight Always have a vision I go by at night I be in my feelings I'ma be fine, need I can feel the blood creeping up from the heathens Got will, got fight, got pride, got reason If they wanna go eat, then you know I'm gonna feed them If you're coming for me, hope you're ready for a demon I can feel the blood creeping up from the heathens Got will, got fight, got pride, got reason If they wanna go eat, then you know I'm gonna feed them If you're coming for me, hope you're ready for a demon so after the painting and furniture refurbishment was complete, it was time to now shop for the deco pieces that we we'll use in the space and also everything that I wanted for that space. And I can tell you for a fact that uh, these shopping errands were not done in a day or in two days. It was something that took several days because it was a gradual process. There were some mistakes along the way, but I think that is what builds a person.
Hi guys, how are you doing? And welcome back. And uh, I'm actually headed to I'm headed to Isili. I need to go shop for a carpet. And there are also some few errors that I need to run. <coughs> and another thing, I had actually taken uh, I had actually taken bought purchased so I had actually purchased the curtain like a week ago. Unfortunately, uh I had forgotten the measurements at home. So right now I'm also going back to that curtain place so that it can be adjusted. The good thing is I told that guy that uh, I'm not sure about the measurements because I'd forgotten them at home. So I asked him to kind of just uh leave like uh fold as in fold the curtains for like uh two inches more so that in case of anything I can take them back to be to be adjusted. So yeah, I'm also headed to that curtain place and uh, also shop for carpet and some other few items. Um, I will also make a stop at Ideal Deco to go pick a portrait that she was making for me. And I'm actually so <clears throat> so excited about the portrait. I don't even know how it turned out. And I know it turned out well because she's the one who has been doing all my portraits. The, all the portraits at home, she's the one who has done them. And they normally turn out so good. So yeah. I'm excited about that and another thing actually <laughs> my hand is is very I'm, I'm actually very tired of holding this phone like this and I'm feel I feel like I should put it down so yeah guys right now let me just actually right now we are packed I'm at a parking space I'm waiting for my hubs he has gone to bed he has gone to the supermarket to pick to pick like a snack so yeah is the one I'm waiting for so right now let me just put this phone down and uh, relax my hand for a little bit and then i will talk to you soon even when you feel low you can still go even when you feel slow you can still go even when there's no hope you can still go i never answered a no man i still go 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 a lot, hustle every single day I'll be making moves till I'm buried in my grave uh, To the system, I don't wanna be a slave I've been doing shit my way uh, Or the highway And in the driveway Is a nice range Cause I grind through the climb I invite pain You never hear me, bitch Nah, I don't complain Just gotta flip the switch And you can go and obtain Anything you want, anything you need Your mind's got the key ingredient It's belief uh, Better see what so guys i think i'm going to have to stop this video here because i lost some clips which would have shared with you but i'm glad i got to share with you the most important parts that i did for this project even though it's not yet complete but i'm so happy that i will have to share with you uh the entire reveal maybe next week i'm actually hoping for next week and uh, yeah so yeah i'm actually unboxing this art that i got from my deal deco i was so anxious on seeing how it turned out and i'm so happy about it so i think i will see you in my next video i hope you get to you get to enjoy this video if you do kindly give it a thumbs up and if you're new here feel most welcome my name is phoebe monica and this channel is all about home cleaning home organization and home deco see you in my next one Best I saying, put them on display on repeat in your brain till you're feeling no more pain. Uh. Never slow yourself down, you can do some more. Push past all the pain. And